Nahum, Nahum, chapter 1. This is a prophecy about Nineveh, the book of the vision of Nahum the el Koshi. Adonai is a jealous and vengeful god. Adonai avenges, he knows how to be angry. Adonai takes vengeance on his foes and stores up wrath for his enemies. Adonai is slow to anger but great in power, and he does not leave the guilty unpunished. Adonai's path is in the whirlwind and storm, and the clouds are the dust of his feet. He rebukes the sea and leaves it dry. He dries up all the rivers. Bashan and the Carmel languish. The flower of the Lebanon withers. The mountains quake before him, and the hills dissolve. The earth collapses in his presence, the world and everyone living in it. Who can withstand his fury? Who can endure his fierce anger? His wrath is poured out like fire. The rocks broken to pieces before him. Adonai is good, a stronghold in time of trouble. He takes care of those who take refuge in him. But with an overwhelming flood, he will make an end of Nineveh's place, and darkness will pursue his enemies. What are you planning against Adonai? He is making an end of it. Trouble will not arise a second time, for like men drunk with liquor, they will be burned up like tangled thorns, like straw completely dry. Out of you, Nineveh, he came, one who plots evil against Adonai, who counsels wickedness. Here is what Adonai says. Though they may be many and strong, they will be cut down. They will pass, and though I have made you suffer, I will make you suffer no more. Now I will break his yoke from your necks and snap the chains that bind you. Adonai gave this order concerning you. You will have no descendants to bear your name. From the house of your God, I will cut off carved image and cast metal image. I will prepare your grave because you are worthless.